So if you have lower back issues or um, glute weakness, your, your butt muscles are weak, specifically the outside part, and you've been working out and now you want to up your game a little bit, this video is just for that using DNS or dynamic neuromuscular stabilization exercises. So stay tuned. <laughs> Hey, this is Dr. Shaky from Irvine Spinal Wellness Center, your Irvine Posture Movement Clinic. So one of the things that we do in the practice is called DNS or Dynamic Neuromuscular Stabilization, all the baby exercises. <clears throat> the link about all of that is in the description box if you want to look that up. So one of the poses that we have is this pose, which is, by the way, what you did when you were about eight months of age. So in this position, your rectangle is rectangular. If you have no idea what I'm talking about, see the other videos that we have under functional movement. So your barrel is engaged and you're sitting as such that your muscles here are pulling you down and the rectangle is rectangular. So you're, in other words, you're not buckled here and all wrinkled up here. So it's nice and rectangular as much as uh, you can. You're pushing the ground away and the foot is about mid thigh, uh, mid, mid leg position. So from this, and you're not necessarily using the top foot to get yourself up. What you're doing is you're actually using the leg from the knee to the foot and your hand. And while you're stabilizing the torso, you are lifting yourself up and you're turning to position yourself into this position, which is called quadruped. I'm gonna turn myself this way. And in this position, you don't wanna be arching your back or making it like a cat. It's nice and neutral. Your neck is gliding up, elongated spine. You're pushing the ground away and your elbows are going towards the back wall without them going towards the back wall. They have that intention. So you're gliding it up. You're pressing from your knees to the foot, pressing down into the ground and keeping yourself upright like so. This exercise will allow the stabilizers in your body to stabilize as your upper and lower extremities do their job to hold you up. And it's a great exercise to practice strength in movement. So going from this position to that position is not necessarily as easy as it may appear. And then controlling the balancing and going into this position again is another one of those exercises that practices your neurology behind and proprioception and balancing in movement which is absolutely necessary with any functional type of activity if you have any questions or if you're questioning how functional you are or you're not and you want to find out contact the office and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching. Take care.